Local underground rapper and opium affiliate Ken Carson is doing a show tonight here in Atlanta, and we're on the streets doing interviews to find out if rap fans have finally learned how to mosh. So I have this idea for a movie. It's called Not Another Teen X Movie. So it starts out, it's a close-up of, of Ken. It's the Project X album cover. Right. And it, it's like a record scratch, and it's like, yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. And to find out how, first, I gotta go way back, way before I was Teen X. It starts with him on the first day of high school, and, like, Yale is playing. <laughs> well, what sort of... What humiliation ritual do you think Ken Carson was forced to perform by Playboy Cardi so that he could get signed onto Opium and grow out his tree limbs? Definitely had to like pick all the dead scabs off his feet or something like that. <laughs> Would you do that to Cardi like for free? Yeah. So are y'all teen X babes? Of course. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. I guess so. So like, well, like, what does that entail exactly? What does it mean to be a teen X babe or teen X in general? Being teen X is just like being a teenager and being on a shit ton of drugs. That's okay, okay, is. okay, okay. I don't think like, it's that. You, it's like, you know, like goth bitches. Yeah. But like hip hop goth bitches. Because if you're doing it in a little peep way, it's kind of cringy in 2022. No, we're not putting it in a little peep way. We're putting it in like that goth scene bitch. So were you guys like seen growing up? Were you like into that wave? I'm gonna be honest, as a kid, I was into a lot of weird shit. Like I fuck with Skrillex a lot. I used to listen to like Slipknot as a kid. Deftones. Yeah. Deftones. Oh wait, wait, Deftones girl? Deftones. Are you are are you guys Deftone girls? I'm a Deftone girl, but not in like the weird TikTok bitch way. I'm a Deftone girl, just I happen to be a girl that listens so to the Deftones. Right I just now. fuck with them. Look at the dog here. Oh, do you have any dogs? Um, I, yeah, I used to have a dog. He actually got hit by a car on Christmas Day like three years ago. Stan Luna, guys. Stan BTS. So, homie just told us his oh, dog so died sorry. on Christmas. So Ariana Grande like is so destroy lonely. Like, Ariana Grande is unironically very opium and very teen I, th I think that at the, out of any, like, female singer right now that's big, I think Lana Del Rey is the most opium person out exactly. there. Exactly! Uh, who the fuck's with yeah. him? Who the fuck's with him? So, who, whose shirt do you think is better? Because I, I really like yours. I think yours is better for sure. Well, I appreciate it. This actually is like, like it's it's real opium merch that. Yeah, you play. Put that shit on. What does it mean to be Teen X? It means you're autistic virgin. <laughs> <laughs> so, are, are you guys gonna all be like moshing tonight? Hell yeah, yeah, of course. Can you give me like a demo of like what moshing looks like to you? It's just like jumping. What I'm not doing that shit. Well, so I, I go to like a lot of hardcore shows. So, hey, hold my mic, I'll two step. Right. I'll like. So you're like, you're like, <laughs> and that's like what moshing is. But in a lot of uh, at a lot of rap concerts, moshing is like you're like pushing people and you're jumping up and down. So you know when Ken says like 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 he's throwing punches in a mosh, but that I think that's what he's referring to. This is very interesting. Yeah, cause look, look. So if I drop my phone, which I did at last concert, Dude, that's I wire it back up. <laughs> that's smart. And I made it for free. That's genius. With a little uh, knit, whatever this is. Twine? Yeah, twine. I think you came straight out of Yale. You're yeah. smart. Oh yeah. <laughs> you knew what two-stepping was. Yeah. Can you explain like like what, what your background is with moshing? I'm kind of a metal fan. I like Zillikami. I saw Yeet uh, back in April, and and people had a lot of like hyper trap shows yeah. that they they want to they want to mosh so bad, but like nobody's really on the same page because they think it means you just jump up and down and kind of like shove people. And, and I'm here to bring violence to the people. I mean, violence can be good. I mean, so the shirt does say autistic virgin, and I I've always viewed moshing as like it's kind of like group stimming. I could see that. Like I feel like it definitely helps autistic people like. Just do their own shit. I agree with this man right here. What you say that shit look like? Lonely, bro? I'm gonna I'm for real throw that to that nigga, bro. I promise you. What does it mean to be Teen X? Teen X baby rolled up and lays it, you know? But, you know, I'm I'm 18 now. So, you know, I'm I'm, I'm X-Man. I'm not Teen X no more. So, it's still it's still a good feeling, you know? How does, it, how does it feel to be an X-Man as opposed to a Teen X? It's just a whole other breed, you know? It feels great. Breed like bareback breeding? Yeah, yeah. So I'm guessing y'all are autistic virgins, am I correct? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Who's the most autistic one here? 
you're, you're autistic. Yeah, autistic, uh, autistic virgin, bro. Have you, you no bodies? Yeah, no bodies, bro. Like no riz either. I mean, yeah, like it's I just have, like I nothing. No game, nothing, bro. Are, are y'all in high school? Yeah, yeah. yeah. What's like the average like fit you'll see at like the the high school? Especially in Atlanta, bro. You gotta have purple jeans, to very tight, extra yeah. tight. Maybe like a V-Lone shirt and probably or some Jordans. Oh yeah, yeah graphic tee. Yeah. For the females, it's really the camo pants. A regular T and or a right re- regular T-shirt and Air Forces. That's all you're seeing, really. Do you think the future looks bright for the youth right now? Nah, we're going to hell, bro. There's no hope. Oh, I'm gay for him. So like a lot, yeah. You're you're actually the only person to ever say that you're gay for Ken Carson. See, like I'm straight, but like Cardi, Ken, and Lone, I'm I'm gay for them. My mom wouldn't, my mom wouldn't care, but like I think my grandpa, he don't be like shit. He's gay as hell. Like, no. Is are the suburbs pretty opium? <laughs> So tell us about yourself. Do you get any play? Do you have any riz? Nah, whatsoever. Nah. You know, I just kind of sit at the crib. I play racing video games, and then I sleep. That's it. We're gonna fix that today. Okay, I know this is gonna be scary, but you're gonna have to go up to a girl. But I'll be right behind you. I promise. There's one in front of you. Gotcha. Okay. He's good. You? Good to hear. Yeah. Uh, talk to talk to her about your interests. Do you like cemetery? <laughs> okay. Okay. Say this. Can I bag it like Devin Booker? Ask her what her favorite color is. What's your favorite color? Red. Like a like oh, Cardi. A whole lot of red. Just to be clear, they played no music, like, there's no music going on right now. There's no music going on. They had a DJ set for about four songs. Things got incredibly active, and uh, the music stopped. Things were still very incredibly active. I'm getting pushed. Do you eat bad bitch pussy for lunch? Of course. Of course? Of course. When was the last time you ate bad bitch pussy, though? Uh, last night at 3 in the morning. Do you know the uh, the reference he's making on the hoodie? Uh, not gonna lie, nah. You know about Crystal Castles? Yeah. How do you know about Crystal Castles? The store lonely. You trying to get merch today? Are you? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, fam. yeah. Wait, hang on for us. I gotta go. Oh, uh, you got the Yale shirt on today? Yeah. Okay. Well, how do you feel about Yale? Did you get a bad bitch straight out of Yale? Yeah. Really? Actually, she's from Cornell, but it's like close. What does it mean to be Teen X? Well, we're not Teen X no more. We're just X. Just X? What does it mean to be X? Um, all black. <laughs> all right, we meet again. Where were we last when we saw you? Babytron. Are you still Babytron's number one fan? Yeah, but we're at a Ken Carson concert. I can't, I can't like deride Babytron. I gotta deride Destroy Lonely. <laughs> If you could be an animal for a day, what would it be? I'd probably be like the wolf from like the wolf meme, you know, where he's like sitting on a mountain, like yeah, chilling. Yeah, you know, and he's like thinking. Ex- that, that's like me, like all the time, except I don't smoke weed. So like this would be me for real. Hey, get us like close up of this shit. This would be like me and like and like my dad or some shit like that. Are they kissing? Yeah. Oh, that's okay. Well, that's nice. You have a great relationship with your father. <laughs> My name is Chloe. Destroy Lonely was be like was like, can you be my destroy Chloe? Would you say yes? I'm me and my boyfriend could be his. We could be <laughs> you, you gotta fight him up. Are you the boyfriend? No, no, no. no. Where's the right now. He's in line right now. Hey. Okay, what would you do if Destroy Lonely tried to get at your girl? Bro, that's crazy. That's crazy. No, that's crazy. You gotta fight him off, right? You gotta fight him off. Dude, I wouldn't I can't go for that, bro. <laughs> you wouldn't fist fight, you wouldn't start swinging, bro? No, I told her no. I told her no already. That's just, you gotta no. You gotta be on some Andrew Tate shit. Like lay, like lay your foot down or something like that, man. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like I'm not going for that. Like I would not fuck with the throw. What if it was a girl? Just two girls. What if it was Rihanna? All right, that's, hey. that's different. Hey. 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 You can have two girls. I can't have two guys. Hey,
All right, so basically how, how moshing at a rap show works, especially one of these bigger hyper trap shows. What's up, what's up, bro? So basically how raging, how moshing works at a hyper trap show is uh, you kind of, you make a really big pit, and then when the beat drops, you, you, you run into each other, and you jump up uh, really hard. Uh, and, and then you don't make any room for anybody else, and if someone falls, you don't pick them up. And that's the rules. Cheese X baby, ecstasy go crazy.